hello welcome to your academy where learning becomes much much easier today i'm going to be showing you a very brief introduction to calculus i'm going to be telling you the general formula and how to apply the general formula of differentiation so if you have a function y equal to a x respond of n this a stands for our coefficient n stands for the power of x so the general law says when we get the derivative that's the y over the x it's going to be a n x raised to the n minus 1 so how do we come about this formula what happened is that the coefficient of our derivative was just the product of the power of x and the coefficient of x so when we have a function and we're asked to find the derivative of the function the coefficient of of our derivative will be the product of the power of the function given and the coefficient of the function and now the new power of our x in the derivative will be the power of our function minus 1 to be the power of our function minus 1 so, so let's see little problem problems that we can use this to solve so we have a function giving us y equal to x cube so i to find the derivative of this function so come to say the y over the x is equal to remember i told you that the coefficient of our, our derivative will be the product of the power and the coefficient of the function so i'll have the power which is three times the coefficient coefficient of x here is one so after that i'll have my x half times x now the power my power here like i said earlier will be the power of the function minus one so I have 3 minus 1 so we have the y over the x simplifying this further to be equal to 3 times 1 3 so I have 3x 3, 3 minus 1 is 2 so the derivative of this function is equal to 3x square and that's how we find the derivative of the function so let's solve another question we have a function y to be given uh, um, as 4x raised power minus 3 and we'll actually find the derivative of this so we'll have our uh, y over the x remember the coefficient of our derivative is going to be the product of the power which is minus 3 and the coefficient of x in our function so we we'll have minus 3 times 4 multiplied by x now the power of our derivative will be the power of the function minus 1 so we have minus 3 minus 1 so I have the y over the x to be equal to minus 3 times 4 is minus 12 so I have minus 12 x minus 3 minus 1 is minus 4 so this is how we get the derivative of a function I know you enjoyed this video if you are yet to subscribe make sure you click on subscription button and the notification bell to get notified each time we post a tutorial video remember in every of our videos we usually do a random shout out to our active followers so make sure you like share subscribe you might just be the lucky one in our next video thanks for watching